One of my residents asked me, what does it take to run a successful practice? My answer was a successful team. When asked when I learned how to build a successful team, my answer was medical variety nights. So let's go back to one of her fondest memories from medical school. For me, I remember playing in a band with a highly talented blues singer who would have given Aretha Franklin a run for her money. Of course, the band was aptly named Urethra and the Ureters. But now let's look at who was really responsible for putting together a variety show. There was a person in charge. They had the vision of what the show should look like and were also involved in the day-to-day -day operations of the show. Next up, there were a number of people who were the talent. In my class, I had a singer who could double for Sting, a comedian who would have Kevin Hart in stitches. There were even gymnasts who could be in a Vegas Cirque du Soleil show if their medical career never panned out. Now, to really make it happen, the performers needed some people behind the scenes to help execute the vision. These were the people who worked tirelessly to build the sets for the acts, were responsible for historically accurate clothing worn by the performers, and remember, they were also responsible for getting the artists on stage at a precise time. And finally, when the big night came, there were another group of people who took over. The ones who gleefully interacted with the customers, took their tickets, ushered them into their seats, and were responsible for dealing with problems if and when they arose. Now let's turn to medical practice and think about the different personnel that are going to make you successful, or as I like to call it, the MANT team. Here, the person who is in charge of the whole operation is your manager. This is the M in MANT. Think of them as your chief operating officer or the person who is responsible for your day-to-day -day operations. This is the head of the medical variety night. The A in the model is your administrative assistant. They are your front line and put a public face on your practice. They will greet your patients in clinic and call patients to book their appointments. They also interact with other doctor's offices to get refer letters and consultation reports out. The N in the model is nursing. Many successful clinics heavily rely on additional manpower to assess patients or perform diagnostic testing. For instance, in my clinic, a nurse is the one who will inject an intravenous dye into a patient's arm when I request a retinal angiogram or give an Ativan to a diabetic patient who is anxious about getting a laser. Lastly, with our increasing integration of technology into medical practice, we need technicians to assist us. For me, technicians will do portions of the ocular examination, such as measuring visual acuity and recording intraocular pressure, and run equipment, such as an ocular coherence tomogram, to give me a highly accurate image of the retina. So as you create your human resource plan, as you start your own medical practice, remember, that the key to success is the MANT team. As you are hiring, remember back to Medical Variety Night and the different types of people that made the event so successful.